Some of you may know, I was surprised with a car for my 16th birthday. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah! Oh. And I absolutely loved it, but it was a used car. So it had a lot of problems and BMWs are not cheap to fix. So we decided to put our money into a brand new car. Hi guys, so let's get into my new car tour. Here's the outside of my car. It is a 2020 Honda Civic. Here's the front, pretty sick. And I did choose white once again because I personally love white. I think it's so clean. And here's the side, nothing fancy. I did get a four door. And this thingy right here is to get into my neighborhood because it's gated. Here's the um, gas tank. It is a capless gas tank. I didn't know that was a thing, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Old Guy. <laughs> Don't mind my steering wheel. I have nowhere else to put my camera. <laughs> Oh my goodness, wait a second. Let me turn on my car really quick. I'm gonna keep the air running, um, so you might hear that in the background, so I apologize about that. I sit really close to the steering wheel, so I'm gonna like scoot back. But here is the passenger seat. This is where I sit, obviously. So on this side right here, we have our little buttons. This controls the windows, and then you're just like your main locks, and then you can adjust your mirrors right here. Over here, this is pretty cool. They have these like little buttons, basically to like control your car. So like this one will yell at you if you like swerve out of a lane. So here's the steering wheel. These buttons right here, this controls like the radio. I can like skip songs. This one turns the volume up and down. This button makes calls, this one ends the calls, and then this makes Siri talk. <laughs> this button right here actually controls my heated steering wheel, so that's pretty nice when it gets a little chilly here in Florida. And then you got other buttons basically for your car. Any driver knows what this is, this is your turn signal left and right. So there is my digital dashboard. Um, everything's digital. My favorite thing about this is that it actually tells you like the number of how fast you're going instead of actually having to read a line. Then I actually had this bejeweled circle thing in my BMW but I just switched it over and it actually fits and it's so cute. I got it from Amazon. I love it. Then my favorite thing in my entire car is, is the touch screen. So then we got our mirror and then I actually added um, some necklace so this one is just like three little stars and then this is a narwhal This was like my team mascot when I did cheer two years ago So it really means a lot to me. So I just hung it up. So they're super cute hanging there up here I just have my mirrors nothing fancy and then I have Two lights right here. I don't have like a sunglass holder or anything. I also don't have a sunroof so moving on to this little part right here, so I do have a touch screen now and it's amazing. So I actually have Apple CarPlay. So I just have this cord and then you plug it in to your phone like so and it does charge your phone when it's plugged in. So Apple CarPlay. So basically it just has a bunch of apps. So I have Spotify. It also has Apple Music but I use Spotify. It shows your text messages and then you have settings, calendar, and just a bunch of other apps. And then you also have your GPS which is nice. So when I'm driving I usually just keep my phone here because I have that little compartment down there. So then I have a scrunchie here because it's always nice to have a pony in the car. And then I have a bunch of little buttons right here. So this thing is amazing. So you literally just press this. And like, for example, when you're going through a drive-thru and you accidentally let go of the brake, your car will not move because it's on brake hold. And I think that's amazing because sometimes I have done that. And now that I have that, I won't have to worry about like hitting a wall when I'm in a drive-thru or anything. And then I also have an econ button. So right here is my storage compartment or you like your main console. I actually made these cup holders myself. I cut them out of like felt paper. So they do absorb the water so it doesn't like leave water stains from your cup. So I think they're super cute. This does move back and then that's a bigger cup holder for like a Slurpee or something. And I don't know if you can see that but I also have another charger if you need that. Open that and then there's more storage down there. And then down there I keep most of my stuff. I have another scrunchie. I have perfume, chapstick, we got hand sanitizer because that is super essential nowadays. Um, and then I just have tampons and stuff. So yeah, that's what I keep down there. 
So when you don't need this cup holder, this actually moves forward. So it gives you like more of an arm space to put your arm when you're driving. So I really like that because I do that a lot. Then over here, I just have a Yankee candle so it makes my car smell good. And then here's this. I have a mask in there because sometimes I forget mine. And then I have more air fresheners. And then I also have a tripod for my camera, but it doesn't work anymore. But I still keep it in there. That's that. Underneath my whole council, um, I have more storage down there. So I actually have another charger port and then a cord to charge your phone. And then I also keep my keys down there. And then over here in that little compartment, I keep an umbrella. So that is everything in the front part of my car. So I'm now gonna show you guys the back of my car. So we're in the back of my car. It's very, very roomy. <laughs> like I have so much room back here. So there's nothing really back here besides the seats. Put these in my car. So this is like a little purse hanger and I got this from Amazon. I only have one. There's the other side. It sits three people. So here's what the front looks like from the back. And then I do have a light up here. It's pretty bright actually. No sunroof as I already said. And I'm gonna show you guys the trunk. So you just hold this button down right here. I literally have nothing in it because this car is so brand new. I don't even know what this is for, but as you can tell, it's very big. I can fit all the groceries and a bunch of stuff, but I definitely will put more in it later on, but that's my trunk. So some really cool things about my car that I personally love is the Apple CarPlay. And then when I reverse, I actually have a back camera so I can see what I'm doing when I'm backing up, which I did not have that in my other car. And obviously, as you can tell, the interior is black. My other car, it was like a light tan and I was fine with either. My seats are also not leather. They were in my other car. And yeah, this car is very roomy. I'm very happy with it. I am so freaking thankful. And I just love my car so much. So yeah, that is my new car tour. I am so happy. I'm trying my best to keep it clean as possible. It's gonna be really hard since I do live in Florida because I go to the beach a lot and you know, but I'm gonna be taking care of it. And this is a brand new car. So there's literally nothing wrong with it. So the only thing that I really have to take care of with the car is just like oil changes, maintenance, and like just daily checkups and like gas. I do have to pay for all of that. So this car will be like my forever car now. Like I will have this car for a really long time, probably until I like turn 20 or like move out. This will be my baby forever. <laughs> so that is my complete new car tour. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you all very soon back with more videos. Bye guys.